Spain, of course, taking to the field for the first time in this edition of the most prestigious festival in world football. No doubt looking for a performance to set a tone. There's his great vocal support. There are many, many who have travelled to watch them, and every one of those supporters willing them to give everything back for the cause. It is beautifully set here. The Estadio José Alvalade in Lisbon, a really impressive arena, named, of course, in honour of the founder of its occupants, Sporting Lisbon. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Germany. Spain looking for a fast start to get things done early here. Yeah, and it's obvious, Peter, you don't want to be playing catch-up after the open group game. So we can expect this to be highly competitive. Three points here and the feel-good factor of eventual progression kicks in. It's a, a great foundation to tackle the rest of the, uh, the group games. So it's away we go then. So Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Jordi Alba. He's got such searing pace, Peter. He gets to the byline in the blink of an eye. And from there, his crosses are, are pinpoint and very hard to defend against. This opposition defence is going to have its work cut out, trying to keep him quiet. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. Up towards the front line. It's a loose ball. Now it's Tony Kroos. Kroos gets it into the middle. Germany are playing with a pleasing width here, especially. Oh, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. He's there. And the finish! Goal! Germany! And Germany are in front! A beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Goretzka plays it out to the wing. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Brings it forward. Borat. Big chance! Kroos has created one goal already. And it's Morata. Oh, it's fallen. Gets into some space. It's come loose. Trying to get there. Morata. Look 
forward. What does he try from here? I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. And that will be the last act of the first half. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. Already up and running for the second half. Spain need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution. And I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Goretzka, great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's Goretzka. And he has been fouled there. Smart save, he had plenty to do. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes. Goalkeeping at its very best. And here's Morata. Well, that's surely a foul free kick. Showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. He's left his man. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Ginter gets it back. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. Now it's Tony Kroos. Goretzka! Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to... There's the shot! And the follow-up... And yes, it's there! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. He was so alert to the possibilities there, great stuff. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take the risk, as cunning as it comes. starting to look very comfortable. Jordi Alba. And here's Morata. Morata decides to play it back. He's tried one. And somehow he managed to miss it. It's a good display of fighting spirit for me. It's been intercepted. That will come to nothing. Mm -hmm. 
just needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And here's Folland. Uh, more than... And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Well, this clearly wasn't the start they're looking for, so they're going to have to bounce back and look to win from now on in. A real test of resolve and of character. Your reflections then, Jim. Well, we can't...